Carla Dockey, it's been a few weeks now since the end of the Swifts 2013 ANZ Championship season. Uh, reflecting back, how would you summarise the season? A uh, bit of a mixed season uh, this year. I think we had some real positives to come out of it. Uh, really good to see some of the young ones get on court, but unfortunately we didn't get the results we wanted. A couple of um, good games. The Vixens win was, was a highlight, but um, other than that, we, we would have wished to have had a couple more wins. Personally, looking back at your shooting stats, you've uh, finished with a 83% uh, accuracy for the season. Um, how does that make you feel? Um, yeah, it's it's good. It's always good um, as a shooter. You aimed, or well, I I hope to to get over the 80s. Um, it would be nice to get higher in the 90s, but at least um, there was some consistency throughout the season with my shooting. So yeah, it's nice to finish on in the 80s anyway. As one of the more experienced New South Wales Swifts on the roster, um, how how pleasing is it to see the development of some of the younger players? Oh, it's fantastic to see the way Paige and Mel have come into the team this year and, and really stepped up and taken the game um, by the horn and, and really, really played well and, and been consistent performers on court. Watching them um, and the energy they bring to the game is really exciting and, and keeps some of us older players fresh. Uh, the ANZ Championship seems to go from strength to strength every season. Uh, how do you get ready for the next year and um, how pleasing is it as an athlete comp competing in this tournament? Um, to, to back up for another year, um, it's nice to have a break and let the body recover. Um, having a bit of time off, it really gets you excited um, and looking forward to the to the next season ahead. So a bit of a break is nice, um, but it's definitely uh, exciting as a player to be part of such a strong competition and seeing it grow from the beginning and seeing where it's at now, um, it's exciting to see where it's going to end up. The ANZ Championship is arguably one of the best netball competitions in the world. Who have you been most impressed with uh, this year in terms of performances on court? Wow. Um, there's been a lot of strong performers. It's been really nice to see so many youngsters step up this year. Um, looking across the board, our team with Paige and Mel um, have really come into their, their own and put a stamp on the game uh, and, and on our team. Uh, looking at Firebirds, some of their youngsters have done a really good job. Fever have also um, been quite strong. The Australian teams have been really strong again this year and it's nice to see um, them all perform consistently and, and still being leaders in the sport. So now during the off-season, apart from enjoying a, a nice rest, uh, what do you do to, to keep fit and to get ready for the pre-season? You definitely can't go into a pre-season cold. Um, I, I try and keep fit and keep active um, in the time off. I live quite close to the bay, so I like to, to get out and about and do a couple of runs around there. There's beaches so close, so just staying out and, and being active, but kind of staying steering away from some of the netball activities. So get a bit of an appetite and excited to come back, but definitely keep, um, keep busy and fit in the off-season.